Alrighty, hey guys, welcome back to the Salty Sunday. Today's episode, we've got Mick here, we've got Enzo right up the front. We've got the beach cart. We're going for some uh, Mulloway. And uh, it's about 38 degrees right now. We're trying to push this cart through this soft sand. Fully loaded up, full of uh, mullet in there. I'm going to get this beautiful slob on camera for you. Alright, let's get this uh, rod in. I've got uh, two rods, I've got one over here. And I've got one straight over there. We're just going to take this whole point. Make sure that's nice and solid. Nice. This one here gets a bit of a heavier sinker just because we're punching into this uh this wind yeah well that's like that for right, just take that off oh, dude that's tight yes give us a good slab tonight we're not keeping any fish today it's all catch and release Try to get the silver ghost on camera for you. We just had a big drive. Nice. All right, we're just moving this rod again. Now the gentleman has left. We're going to get the sweet spot. You gotta do what you gotta do. It's a nice little hole out there. That's what we want to hit. That's where the mullies are. Well, that's what we think. Nice. Nothing has picked it, which is absolutely awesome. Okay. Set the scrapnel back up. Move everything. Five minutes. That's that one we just changed. Whoop bang! in the three meter hole oh, and I want all three of us to be uh, fish on tonight We've done some sessions without nothing just full on donuts is that taken yes so we have five baits out now guys oh well four mix changing that one there one two three four Five, but check out these pelicans. How cool are they? Oh look, this guy thinks I'm gonna feed him. They are wicked. He's probably gonna snatch my GoPro, but uh, a little bit of entertainment while we're waiting for a fish. So yeah, from here, it's over there. Mull away, come on. Bait's constantly here, yeah. getting picked. Here o'clock. Here we go. Oh, I 
Get the lights out, Enzo. That's what we're going to do. These babies here. Oh yeah. I can't believe that you know Earl and all that, do you? Oh yeah. I don't know those guys. That guy had just casting, 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 and I finally hooked it. Finally hooked the next day. I've got green ones and I've got ones that go red as well. Ooh. See how bright these guys are. Red at the Look at that. Are oh, these just green ones? These are just green ones. Put the glowies on. Alright, there. Sweet. I've got some ones that turn green to red. And that's the dark side to these babies. There you go. Folks, we've got another bait change going on. Could be a mully around here somewhere. what we do just leave that skin on we we'll just keep adding to this bait just make sure it looks nice and presentable what's going on here all right yo bang 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 that skin over there straight through ah, through the other skin you watch this guys that there is going to get the, the beautiful silver ghost. Water. Five to eight. As soon as it's done being full, we'll be able to just mm. follow that tide out a bit. We'll be able to hear all the rods. Fish on, fish on. We got a fish. This is what we're here for. Come on. Oh yeah. There he goes for his run. Just from all away. So, yeah, it is. Uh, we got here about five o'clock. And um, just been change of bait, change of baits. And we know this spot doesn't really have any sharks or stingrays. I'm just going to... Uh, not jinx myself. Beautiful. Come on. Wants to go. The wind is really blowing right now. The tide has just changed. Got a fresh mullet on all of them. The 
boys were going on about this this had a hit before I didn't see it oh yeah yeah we're just taking my time brother that is a good one I'm telling you the way it took off and it, that second run was good as well. well this is what we're here for aren't we bloody oh oh yeah baby just letting the rod and reel do its thing what mate he wants to run, he wants to run, innit? Good fish, eh? Yeah. Oh, that, that is a good fish, mate. Well, Mick's been going on about uh, this spot. Got mull away. And I was like, oh, no, nah, this place is a myth, but, hey. Which spot is it, mate? Sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and so he gave it to Mick, and then, uh, and now they've given it to me, and um, it's a secret spot, so please don't ask where it is. Nah. Got a bit of weight in that, Jimmy? Yeah, well, I don't want to. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. I don't want to give it too much because I've got a smaller hooks on. So I'm yeah, hoping. That, that was two big runs. That were good runs. Well, he just wants to go. Run again, mate. Yeah, they go hard, don't they? Oh, they go hard. They're good. The miss is busted. Not yet. Oh no, he's there. Sorry, that just didn't feel that didn't feel too good, man. Like he lost one hook out of his mouth, eh? Oh, come on, give me a break. I better nurse him in, eh? Oh, how's that done you? He's done me. He's done me. He's done me. <laughs> what has he done here? What? Oh no. All three hooks. <laughs> Are you serious? You haven't had him run like that before? And the ones we were getting were like this, Jimmy, like not small fish. <laughs> oh my. I've never lost a fish here like that. Nah. Oh, right. Yeah, so I've just lost my mull away, but I reckon another rod's gonna go off in any second now. So I'm just gonna re-rig guys. Um, you get that, it's taken my uh, three hooks right down to the gullet, so maybe the gills frayed the line a little bit, but hey, uh, you get that. Let's get this rig sorted and get back out there. Alright, pick it out. Yeah, yeah. Devastated. Freaking devastated, guys. You don't understand. Super devastated. Now you believe us, Jimmy? No, I believe you now. I'm sure that's my fish, guys. <laughs> Can't believe that. Don't reel that other rod in yet. Is that my fish? No. Is that a fish? No, no, that's a bag. That's a bag. I was about to say, I've got three hooks in his gills. It's done me. So I've just lost a fish and I'm re rigging up and the mix has gone off. It doesn't matter if I've lost mine, we're just here to catch a ghost for the camera. Come here. Hours and hours land base, just trying to get a ghost. We've come up. I'm not going to say anymore. Something might happen. So I'm using a 10 footer. Mick's using his boat rod. They're a long way away, maybe be fine. The little Stella, the little Stella 5000. Oh man, I didn't even hear it. I'm so used to seeing the lights turning red. Oh, there he is. Oh yeah. Could be a shark. No, you told me there's no sharks here. <laughs> no, that's a mull away, bro. 
No, it's a mulloway. Don't worry about that, it's a little mulloway. You got him? Oh no, Enzo! <laughs> <laughs> You got it? No, oh, mate, it's alright. I got him. That's a good fish. We got too. the fish! <laughs> <laughs> we got the fish, Mick! Well, he's a goodie. That's what we've been chasing. He wasn't going, I wasn't letting him go, don't worry. <laughs> Beautiful ghost. <laughs> Straight in there. Oh, oh. you got that on, Bill. <laughs> Come on, mate. How's it going here? Thank you, mate. Look at that. Mick, you want to get those pliers and we'll get these hooks out of his mouth. Yeah. Look at that. It's cool too, look at Whoa. He's nice and chunky, yeah, isn't he? he's a good looking fish. Very good looking fish. Very healthy, mate. Eh? Come on. Come on. See how silver they are here? Beautiful, eh? Yeah. That's just from the salt water. Yeah. That's a beautiful fish. Come on. I'm gonna get you back, mate. Get you. Oh. I lost mine. But I'm super happy actually just to see one come up. Gee, they're a beautiful fish, Enzo. Oh, they're, they're unreal, mate. He's gotta be right. Oh. 10 kilo? Oh, easy. Easy, eh? Yeah. Yeah, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Mick, we'll get these, um, Hand, yeah, because he's got he's got all those hooks. Here we go. He's really taking that in the side. Perfect. Good. Let's grab that end. I'm gonna take a quick photo. Mick with his mull away. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we come for. Bloody beautiful, brother. All right, let's, let's do this for us. Yeah, he's still strong. What a magical beast! He's strong, man. He's strong, yeah. He's gonna go any second. Come on, baby. He's alright. He's, no, he's, he's good. He's good. He's looking good, he's, he's looking good. Go. We'll there he goes. Yeah, yeah boy! Yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah. Boys! Yeah! Alright, let's go. Let's catch another one. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, we've got to be happy with there that, boys. Oh, that was the mission to come here and get a mull away. We did it. Yeah. Yes! Time to rebait. We're just going to leave this on there. So when you get the stomach like that, curl it in like that. That's what we do. Will it work? It usually does. And uh, just put that baby on. Oh yeah. Okay. There's that hook. That middle hook's got to go all the way through, guys. God, Mick's got another one here. What is going on? You got him? So Mick is on. The rod's just gone off. So we've just changed all these baits. That's that's straight ahead, eh? Stop run. Front and left. Okay, so we've just baited all these rods. Mix has gone off. Of course. Same size? Maybe not. And the little Stella. The little Stella 5000 is getting a workout, eh? Oh. So we just got the boat rod here, guys. You don't actually need a big rod here, if you're wondering. Probably actually quite good to reel this in with that, Mick. Much easier. Is that a smaller one, Mickey boy? Yeah, it's a small one. In. Oh, 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 a few head shakes there. <laughs> Lovely. Let me, let me beat you some in. Yeah, mate. I won't jump in the water. <laughs> How 
like that, eh? I've lost mine. Mick got one. Got another one. Oh! First, we've got to get it in. But if you're catching three mull away in the night, what a session! Oh! Can't be too far, eh? It's just on that drop off. Right on that drop off, isn't he? There he goes. Oh, where is he? Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Yep. Look at that beautiful fish. Mick's going to beach this fish. I'm not going to touch it. Look at that, guys. Just in, look. Oh, yeah, he's got a lip there. He's only in the lip. <laughs> well, we're going to put him back anyway. Yeah, he's going to release it. Give me that. Free spool, buddy. There's the book. Show him for the camera. <laughs> He's croaking, if you could hear this, he's croaking. Look at that, back. that's bloody beautiful. Let's put him back, guys. This one's got a bit of life about him, so. So we're just on out on a boys trip. We just don't have the room for fillets. <laughs> Look at that, he's off. I want to chase him. <laughs> wow. There we go, boss. Done it again. How's that with the bait, eh? Look at that. Yeah. Nice. You could use that again. Picks it up. That was awesome. That's cool. There you go. Three mile away in a night session. That is cool, eh? So when you're chasing fish, guys, really check out your rig. You can see that line's going under there. With all that friction and rubbing, that will snap. So we've just got to uh, fix this up. That bait's still good. Plenty of meat left on that. Bait presentation's a really good key. There you go. Nice rig. Go again. Alrighty folks, how's that for a mull away session? Uh, three mull away tonight. Uh, one miss from me. Mick got two, Enzo was a little bit quiet, but yeah, we just uh, absolutely nailed it out there. I'm really, really looking forward to tomorrow's session out here on the beach, but um, it's all new to me, all new to Mick out here as well. We haven't tried it, but Enzo has. He's going to show us around, but man, what a brilliant session. Um, if you really like this, give us a thumbs up, give us a comment. Uh, give us a subscribe. We're going to go out there tomorrow night and do the same thing. But tomorrow, we're going to hit the beach. Uh, maybe uh, Taylor. We need to do a bait session as well. Uh, maybe soak a bait, but we'll see how we go. I reckon I need a shower, but we'll see you guys tomorrow. Stay tuned. Stay salty. Yo! Me go ring time. Somewhere in that seaweed, I think. <laughs> <laughs>